Flavortown's beloved mayor has captivated audiences for more than a decade with his bold style and even bolder personality. But behind the spiky bleached hair and flame-adorned shirts lies a devoted family man who gushes when speaking about his wife of nearly 30 years. Join Facts First as we present Guy Fieri opens up about his wife, your heart will melt. Humble Beginnings Guy Pieri's path to culinary fame had humble beginnings. His entrepreneurial spirit was sparked at 10 when he opened his own pretzel stand after being inspired by a tasty soft pretzel he tried on a family ski trip. With encouragement from his father, Fieri retrieved the pretzel supplier's contact info from the trash and soon set up shop selling pretzels with a homemade cart. He ran the pretzel stand on the weekends all the way through high school, using the profits to fund a transformative year abroad in France. According to Fieri, that year living and working in the kitchens of France was where his passion for food caught fire. He was in awe of the bustling bistros, the renowned chefs, and the appreciation for food as a craft. Fieri has said the experience made him realize his calling was to one day run his own restaurant. Wasting no time, he enrolled at the University of Nevada Las Vegas' prestigious hospitality program after returning stateside. He soaked up all aspects of the restaurant business while working his way up with every job opportunity that came his way. The ambitious 20-something was ready for the ultimate challenge, opening his own restaurant. Alongside business partner Steve Gruber, Fieri launched Johnny Garlics in 1996, an Italian joint in his adopted Santa Rosa, California hometown. The endeavor was a resounding success, capturing the hearts and taste buds of the local community. He expanded the concept to two more locations over the next several years. Little did he know he was in the infant stages still of building his culinary empire. Fate came calling in the form of an audition tape for the next Food Network star competition in 2006. Urged by his friends to try out, Fieri reluctantly sent in an audition on a whim. But the moment Food Network execs pressed play, they heard the sizzle of a star in the making. Though the idea of being a TV personality had never crossed his mind before, his friend's intuition proved correct. Winning the competition launched Guy's Big Bite on Food Network later that year, setting Fieri on a path towards becoming a celebrity. Lasting Love Behind every great man is a great woman, and for Guy Fieri, that woman is his wife of nearly 30 years, Lori. Their meet-cute seems plucked from a romance novel, with Lori marching unannounced into Guy's restaurant, defending a friend who had just been fired. According to Guy, there was immediate chemistry when he locked eyes with the, quote, blue-eyed blonde girl giving me this mean mug. He still jokes Lori never made it to her intended destination of San Diego after moving to California because she fell for the charismatic restaurant owner. While the attraction was instantaneous, their love story is one of compromise, trust, and respect forged over decades together. As Guy's celebrity grew, Lori embraced her role as a supportive partner while raising their two sons, Hunter and Ryder. Rather than be distracted by the glare of the spotlight, she focused on providing stability and a nurturing home life. Guy attributes much of his success to having his family beside him throughout his climb to fame. According to insiders, Lori playfully keeps Guy's eccentricities in check with wit and wisdom earned from their nearly 30 years as a couple. While she accepts Guy's signature spiked bleach blonde hair is part of the brand, Lori has confessed she wishes he would embrace his natural silver fox looks. Guy remains utterly devoted to the woman he calls his soulmate, claiming he still gets butterflies when Lori walks into the room. The fierce protection goes both ways as Lori rushes to defend any naysayers, criticizing her husband's bombastic on-screen persona not matching his tender off-camera devotion as a family man. After weathering the storms of raising teenagers and building a media empire together, the couple have emerged stronger than ever. Date nights are sacrosanct where they giggle like love-struck teens over dinner away from their empty nest. While both are outspoken about the effort it takes to maintain a healthy marriage in the public eye, they brush off rumors of trouble as occupational hazards. Both Guy and Lori view the work they put into their partnership as setting an example for their sons' future relationships. Nearly 30 years later, the Fieris show no sign of slowing down. Heartaches and Triumphs 
Guy has experienced incredible highs as well as devastating lows throughout his path to fame. One tragedy was the loss of his younger sister, Morgan, to cancer in 2011 at just 38. Guy was heartbroken to lose his little sister and best friend as he described her. After her passing, he helped launch the Morgan Fieri Fund in her honor to raise money for other families facing pediatric cancer. Keeping Morgan's giving spirit alive through charity work was part of the grieving process for Guy. He also found solace by fully immersing himself in his exploding career. Just two years after Morgan's death, Guy experienced one of his proudest professional accomplishments in 2013 when he was honored with a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Having his name cemented alongside culinary legends was validation that his unconventional path had made him an icon in his own right. He had successfully parlayed his initial Food Network fame into a sprawling empire. He launched Guy's American Kitchen and Bar, eventually expanding to over 75 locations globally. His line of sauces, spices, and cookware flew off shelves. He crisscrossed the country, highlighting hole-in-the-wall eateries on diners, drive-ins, and dives, which remains one of the network's longest-running shows after over 30 seasons. Book deals and product endorsements added to his ballooning bank account. His distinctive style even inspired inspired a famous movie character with Melissa McCarthy basing her breakout role in Bridesmaids on Guy. Soon he was pulling double duty on other networks like NBC, judging cooking contests, while never slowing his packed filming schedule with the Food Network. Yet with all his professional triumphs, he continued giving back. He worked tirelessly for the Make-A-Wish Foundation, providing over 250 wishes for critically ill children. During the height of COVID, Guy's Restaurant Relief Fund raised over $25 million to support struggling restaurant workers. After losing his sister, Guy learned to appreciate the preciousness of time with loved ones. He started the tradition of Sunday gravy, where extended family gathers for a homemade meal amidst their hectic lives. The tender family man behind the bold persona took precedence as Guy evolved. The Real Guy while audiences may think they know the larger-than-life Guy Fieri, according to Lori, his signature bleached hairdo was never an intentional style choice. Rather, it was the result of a fateful day at the salon. When he emerged from the colorist chair as a blonde for the first time, Lori was stunned, later confessing she wished he had consulted her at first. Yet the dramatic makeover proved timely, aligning with his rising celebrity status as it became his trademark look. Parenthood is Guy's proudest achievement alongside his culinary empire, with Lori describing him as fully devoted to their boys. Now it's time to hear from you. Are you a fan of Guy Fieri? What surprised you about his story the most? Let us know in the comment section below.